feel like I'm in a jungle with these plants around me. However, today we're doing something completely different. Kerwan, who I work with a bunch, you maybe seen him on my Instagram, said that now that we've got this set up, we should test out Reddit. I've actually, I don't know if I sound like a really old person who, you know like your grandma where she's like, what is the Facebook? I feel like that. I've never been on Reddit and we're going to discover it together today and I'm going to react to it and I hope it's uh, decent because if I have zero reaction this video is going to be incredibly boring. So Reddit, what can you give it? What am I saying? That makes no sense. Right, I removed the mufflers. Sorry, not sorry. Dad, too loud. <laughs> Uh, oh, he's got a little Gumball 3000 uh, keychain. I have I have been here before because uh, my the what, my car is straight piped and my previous my first black Lotus was completely straight piped as well. And um, I got messages like this from my parents, but they're super chill. Like it was kind of in a good laughing way with them. But yes, I'm sure a few people maybe watching this video have been there. Almost done, honey. Just have to finish the interior. <laughs> no, I've heard. It's someone once told me, but I thought it was a joke. People will actually do this. I mean, I guess it's effective. It, pr it works. Sure, you get rid of the dust. That is, that is brutal. <laughs> oh no. Oh, what an inconvenient. I mean, first of all, I hope everyone is okay. What an inconvenient spot to have an accident right behind that sign. Is that real or is this photoshopped? Because that is incredible. You know what would be amazing now is if someone just put a your welcome sign on the back of the car. <laughs> Told him we needed more stability. <laughs> incredible. This is absolutely something i would do i remember once um <laughs> I, a girl once told me um i'd love to be in a relationship but i feel like it's already taken up by you and the cars <laughs> i was like that is a bit worrying at that point if someone tells you that i probably shouldn't that's probably way too much personal info but so yes fantastic whoever said that what is going on here no no guys <laughs> who has done this and oh no what's this mercedes dodge what is that that should be these two things should that should be a fine if i was a policeman and i saw, i mean first of all the one on top they've gone over the windshield so i mean you can't drive that but the one below that should be a fine i mean you know hilarious but what is what is going through your mind is that, do people do this to get on this, to get on Reddit? Or is this something that just, like, is this a passerby who took that photo and someone was just cruising with his Dodge with a massive Mercedes logo? And then that person decided to upload it on Reddit? Or did they put that on with the purpose of getting it? That is, and there was a very big difference in how I feel about that, depending on the answer to that question. Do you know what I mean? Why do we need a pool if we have a pool on wheels? That's fantastic. I'd never thought about that. And if it gets a little bit chilly, you just rev it and the heat from the exhaust will... It's, it's a heated pool. Geniuses. How had no one ever thought of that? And how was that not on Top Gear? I feel that's something they would do. When your car gets a dent, cover it with a band-aid. Oh, no way. Wait, what is going... Is that actually what's happened? No, we will never know. We, it will be, it will remain a mystery. Enough said. What an entrance. A superstar rolled up in the black Ferrari. Mm. Is this Daily Mail? It must be Daily That is a classic Daily Mail. How can something of that size not have regular checks? I'm getting way too... Okay. This aggravates me. This very, really aggravates me. I feel like we could... This is so avoidable. Okay. Moving on, moving on. What have we got now? New foil. Ooh, ah, aggressive. I don't like that. Ooh. Odd. Odd. Slam the door. What's this? What's what going on? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. That is a bad door slam. There's your lesson. Never ever slam a door. That should be rule number one. <laughs> Hope they were okay. <laughs> nice guy would be ashamed of someone. <laughs> that is the worst. When you come back to your car, all parked, all nicely cleaned, and that has happened, we need to avoid this. My friend makes fun of me for driving an automatic HHRSS. Okay, the... Nope. Don't get it. Lambo doors. Oh, I'm curious. How do we feel about this? Aftermarket Lambo doors. Yes? Or no, comment down below. I've, mm. I mean, each to their own. Everyone has their own taste. I've seen it on certain cars and thought it looked cool. I've seen it on other cars and I thought it was the worst thing in the world. We will never know. What would you pick? How to choose your car? Cheap, fast, reliable. Can only have two. Cheap and fast. And I'll deal with the reliability later. Cross that bridge when you get there. That's my theory. Cheap and fast for me. 
Is that stupid? Because then it's not going to end up being cheap anymore, is it? But then you, can, you want it to be cheap. I guess it kind of may be fast and reliable. Because if it's fast, if it's cheap but not reliable, you're going to spend a fortune on it anyways. Aha! Uh, we have cracked the code. Cracked it. Fast and reliable. You're not getting me. Aftermarket headlights. Don't be left to, I mean, that's just, that's just not legal, is it? There's nothing, there's absolutely nothing legal about that. So, yes, uh, <laughs> I'm sure it's effective, but it's not going to work, is it? <laughs> Am I the only one who likes to show off about my car, lol? We've all been there at some point where you're super proud and you get your phone out and you're showing people photos and then you think, Am I that douchebag? And the answer is yes. <laughs> New budget cut footage. No. This has to be a rendering. This, yeah, there's no way. This has to be a rendering because that is the least intimidating thing ever. Yeah. <laughs> I really, oh, is that a rendering? I want answers. I want to know. Just going to leave this up for interpretation. 2017 Chevrolet Camaro 1 Liberty Coupe rear wheel drive. That is just a straight up lie. Whoever has clicked on that has been, well, fraud. When you have to drive an automatic. That's quite good. And that's one of those old, old automatics as well. Vroom, vroom. What is that? Those exhausts. What is going on? It's got like a Liberty Walk kick, the concave, the dish on those rims. And well, we, if, if you can even call that a double wing, I mean, what? Mm. To each their own. To each their own. And this one, <laughs> the title of this one is just horrid looking Audi A3. I mean, <laughs> I thought these were meant to be funny. That's just, that's just brutal. I mean, that person has put a lot of effort into that car and um, it, to their taste, it's probably fantastic. Brutal. Don't spoil it, mate. <laughs> I've been, <laughs> I was, I've been got by a crap joke. <laughs> what is the fact, these mini spoilers are a thing. And does he have like 599XX or Ferrari FXXK winglets on the side of this thing? He is loving life, this guy. The most reliable car Lotus has ever made is the Tesla Roadster. <laughs> uh, if you understand the reference to that, you know exactly what they're talking about. And if you don't, I will let you Google that. Shall we end there? I'm sorry, Elon Musk. We're going to end there. Uh, yes, let me know. That was fun. I could spend all day reading through these things, but uh, yeah, I'm going to keep going through these. And if you want to kind of enjoy them together more, let me know in the comments. In the meantime, hope you enjoy this little setup. Hope you guys are well. This is fun. I feel like, <laughs> I feel, is it, is it kind of sad that I felt like you guys were here with me enjoying these things? It's kind of fun. I enjoyed it. I hope you guys did. And uh, I'll be seeing you again very soon. Cheers. Bye-bye.